Hello, Libra. Welcome to your reading. This reading is going to be for Libra Sun, Moon, Rising. Please only take what resonates, leave what does not. If you find something here that resonates, make sure you give this reading a big thumbs up. Happy birthday, Libra. Let's see what's coming out for you. All right, we have the King of Pentacles coming out. All right, so there's somebody. Okay, there's a person that's dedicated to control. Okay. They really want to control you. They want to control some type of choice. They want to stop something. It's like they want to end something. They want to control some type of choice um, that you're making. Or they want to be able to control your choices. Somebody could also be wanting to be able to control you. Okay. There's some new beginning that you could possibly be starting that this person wants some control over. Um, and you're hiding information about it. And you're not telling them. They feel like you're not telling them about it. Or you're not telling them everything about some type of new um, new beginning that you're starting. Okay. They, okay, so this person feels like that you are starting some type of... Um, This person could think that you're starting a relationship with someone. That you've recently started a relationship with a person. Also, this they find it. So you could have cut off someone or cut, cut off a group of people or someone that you used to hang with or used to talk to you could not talk to them anymore or just stop talking to them and they feel like that that's suspicious because feel like something is suspicious and they feel like they have to control you in order for you to I also feel like someone feels like that they have to control you because they don't trust you Somebody doesn't know what you're juggling. Okay, so there's something else that you're doing. You're coming up as the lovers. You're coming up as honest to this person. Um, as being honest. And also I'm getting, you see this eye contact? But I'm getting like a person be like, look, look me in my eyes and tell me this. Or how they look you in your eyes is weird. This person is happy when you're scared. There's a person who's happy when you're like anxious or you're in fear or you're like just going through some type of emotions. Whoever this person is, they actually like it. They're like, they're satisfied. They got you right where they want you. Why do they want you? Let me see. Okay, so, wow, a person wants you in your feelings and they want you going through an emotional storm because they feel like if you're at peace, you would, you would leave. If everything was just stable, then you would just, you would leave them. You would get bored and you would leave or you would just be peaceful enough where you don't need them anymore or something like that. Um...
I just also got like somebody's trying to get you to stay forever. What is going on? Something has been revealed. This could either be you coming up as a magician or them coming up as a magician, but somebody is really like powerful. Um, someone is able to kind of like, I'm also getting like a person is able to kind of like play with your feelings or something like that. Trying to create an, create an illusion of happiness. Or well, somebody's trying to create some type of an illusion of what's fair or an illusion of what's right or an illusion of what's wrong. It's just creating a bunch of illusions here. Someone is just creating a bunch of illusions. All right, let's see. Okay, so there's a bond that could be rooted in confusion. So somebody is hell bent on you staying confused. If you start if you start thinking straight, you just might leave them. Let me see. What do you do to make them feel like you need to be confused? Because <laughs> you know too much I'm getting like you could be a little nosy or you could be you pick up on things quickly coming out as the page okay so yeah you pick up on things too quick too 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 quick Yeah, you pick up on something too quick. You pick up on things too quick. All right, what's the, what's the, see you turning over. What's the outcome of this? It's the Ace of Cups somehow. <laughs> somehow, some way there's love, um, abundance. Something is coming here. Also with the death card, there's a rebirth. Okay, yeah, this is going to create a tower. However, this person is trying to control the relationship and it's kind of comical um, because while I can see the story, I just don't get why this person would want you to be confused and feel like having you confused creates a happy, creates something happy and solid. If anything, that would be them self-sabotaging and that would be them self-sabotaging, thinking with the lower vibration of themselves, thinking in a low vibration and thinking that they're actually saving a relationship, but they're actually sab sabotaging the relationship. So, um, yeah, this is definitely going to need to a reboot. Um, but we do have some good energy for the future. Uh, we also do have the death card. So there's a rebirth, rejuvenation. Something has to end and be done with. Um I also see the Ten of Wands, so it's it's a lot. It's, this definitely looks draining. Anyway, let me see with the other deck. Has to say to us. is coming out for Libra. Let's spray. Let's spray that. So 
someone's focused. Someone's focused. Somebody is dedicated. All right, we do have the Eight of Swords here. So you could be stopping yourself from receiving or it's the energy of you second guessing like praise, love type of energy. Um, there's a person who you feel is not being honest with you or there's a, there's somebody who's giving you this all of these compliments this goes this is like the energy of you receiving a lot of compliment compliments and you're saying like no 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 rejecting um this praise this this love energy we do have the world so you're confused about this level up you're confused if something is yours there's this energy of you having this um, big level up, this ending of congratulations. Um, also graduation energy. And you're confused that this is yours because it comes in so fast. You do got the Knight of Swords coming in. It comes in very, very fast. And we do have the Devil card. You feel like something is coming too fast, so it got to be the Devil. Or somebody is doing something too fast, so this guy, somebody is trying to... Um, manipulate me. This could also look like love bombing, like something happening too fast, like you're you're falling too deep, too fast, and I don't trust it. Type of energy. You're also just a little bit um. It's like, I'm also getting this energy like you, you've you been working too hard and you don't have time for like another repeated offender or another a repeat offense or something like that. Something's happening way too fast for you and it's like, wait a minute. Someone is also giving you this recognition and it's happening. It's like in the blink of an eye and you're confused. You're confused about this new level. Like talk about really going through the portal. Like you actually went through a portal and you're like, wait a minute. Everything I want? No, it must be a trick. Which some of you guys could have definitely went to this new this new level. Okay. Yes, I told you somebody was really focused, dedicated. You left something that wasn't serving you and you dedicated on something that you really love. Someone that you really love. Something that you really love to do. Um, you do have the king of swords here. So it's because you know the truth about something or you know the truth. The truth is. All right. So you know why something was so hard. You know why something was so like. Even when the tower fell, it was still like drama somewhere. And you kind of left something and focused on yourself or focused on your craft or focused on what made you happy. Dedicated. All right, you're exhausted. Someone, oh, you're exhausted right now. All right, so you're drained, but you're, it's a happy drain. Um, energy or you could be drained with housework even though you may like doing housework like you may love being a mom or a dad but your kids could be driving you crazy um it's just that type of drained energy for some of you guys you could be going back like in like a love spell hmm somebody could be in a love spell You could feel like you're in a love spell. Something feels like, yeah, it does feel smoky. All right, something does feel smoky. 
It does seem a little weird. There's a person who's thinking that their goal is a family. Oh, I hope you ain't hear my stomach growl. But the goal is a family. Somebody's goal is to rebuild this. I want to rebuild what we once had. I want to rebuild a foundation. Oh, I want to build a foundation. This is this is the this is the goal, the focus, the dedication. I want to build this. I want to have this this foundation. Let's see. All right, justice is here. This is justice. This is justice that's here. Somebody's peeping in too. But this is a justice is coming through with a new idea or some type of new way of thinking or with some newness that's coming in that may seem like fog, but this is. This is justice. There's a need for you to be open. Um, someone is going to want to move pretty fast with you. And this is could be a lover. All right. All right. So I'm going to leave it right here. I hope this reading resonates. If it does, make sure you give this reading a big thumbs up. I love you guys. And I will see you in the next video.